Hi, this is Prasenjit Saha from Informatica GCS. Today I'm going to show you how to export developer client mapping into Power Center repository. Here is the developer client mapping. Once done, we need to uh, previously we can export it to Power Center by taking a export of XML and then import it import that particular XML from the repository manager or from the power center designer here in the developer client we have the option to export it directly to the repository folder so I have validated the mapping now I will go for the export right click on the mapping name click on export here I have multiple options I will maximize the screen So I will choose for power center. Next. Here first of all I need to choose the release which version I need to do. I have 10 to 0 available so I will go for 10 to 0. It should be obviously with a matching version. Power center repository browse. So here I need to provide the repository details after clicking on browse and you need to provide the host name, port number of the node, administrator, username, password and the repository name. This should be exactly same whatever you can collect from the admin console. So once I clicked on OK, it is showing connection to the repository is successful. Now I need to, I can select the folders whichever are available into that repository so let's select any of the folder and I have the I have various options to convert it into maplet and choose the code so I can choose it to be a maplet and placed on the repository folder also I have the option to choose the code page if required otherwise I can left it untouched so click on next finish so it will ask me to verify the login into the MRS again and it is exporting So the export is successful. We will go to the power center repository and check for the mapping. So this is the repository and folder where I have exported. So let me open the folder. Mappings. So here is the mapping. Let me just maximize the mapping screen. So this is the mapping got imported in power center repository. In this way we are avoiding to create to import any developer client mapping into power center using the XML and we need to just create the workflow session to run this mapping. Thank you very much for watching the video.